Hi Pisces, how are you? You know how welcome and I miss me show and this is yes, your weekly reading. I want to remind you guys that my reading is coming today. They are giving you guys that everything has free well and that everything is going to resonate with everybody. And please keep in mind that rules give you the in between energies as always around no daycare. You guys should know that if this is general, feel free to take leave whatever you want. And with it said, let's move forward with Pisces reading today. <clears throat> Let's see. So we have right away towards Vigo Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, it's also referencing mermaids for whatever reason, but hey. Moving from this, um, it's saying right here that somebody who you could still have some feelings for or you still like uh, that you haven't reached out or you guys haven't talked to each other, I do see that this person still thinks about you. This, this person could spot on you here and there as well. With the Six of Swords in the reverse and the Two of Cups right here in the reverse, I do feel like you may wonder if this person has moved on from you, but they haven't. Right now, they could have somebody else, let's say that they're talking to other people or they could have an, be in a relationship, but they're not really into that relationship. They're just there because they just wanted company. That's what I'm seeing here. And, you know, moving from this, I do see that this person hasn't moved on from you completely. They still have feelings for you. So if you were to pop back into your li into their life, I feel like things could actually go in a very surpri surprising route for you and them. With um, with the 10, oh, hold on, guys. I'm back, sorry. I just moved too much and, and something fell. But either way, I do see, like, this person is still, like, have feelings for you. With the Ten of Pentacles in the reverse, I do see like this person's uh, newer lover or whatever you want to call has actually told this person, hey, let's get married or let's get this into higher levels of commitment. And this person hasn't want to because they still have some sort of hope in to see you again or maybe work things out with you in the future. With the Four of Pentacles, they have been stuck on your energies and how they feel for you and whatever you guys had for a long time yet they don't say anything because i do feel like this person has a lot this person has a lot of pride they don't want to actually come across as needing so even if they felt a certain way they're not gonna tell you because it's a pride sense in the way um with the five of swords and the justice and reverse libra energy i do see right here that this person feels like you may not feel the same way or that you could judge them i don't know why they're feeling like that but they feel like maybe you're mad at them i also see right here that this person is like over thinking and looking at all the things you guys could have done differently or that they should have done differently they do also feel very very guilty and how things were handled i feel like you both have some sort of like ways and handling things better but overall this person feels like yeah i handle it so differently or i should handle it differently with the ace of pentacles and the reverse i do see that they do acknowledge that you guys could have been so much more and that things could have worked so much better or in a better light and they do feel like there was a missed opportunity they play memories over and over and over just uh imagining how life could have been or how things could have ended in a different note in between the both of you with the nine of ones in the reverse uh they just haven't had the time and or the strength to get to get out there and tell you how they feel uh they don't want to bother your life they feel like maybe you have moved on and this is because neither of you have maybe talked to each other in a in a minute so this person is like you know like what if i reach out and i just interrupt his happiness or her happiness so just so you know pisces they have actually kept their distance because they just feel like they will be bothering you in a way shape or form but they have been wanting to do so or at least have been wanting to see you or have the opportunity to speak to you or have the opportunity to i don't know try things with you but i feel like again a lot of things are in the way 
with the chariot right here cancer energy i do feel like the same way in your life and in their life there's a lot of people in the way or had had a lot of people in their way i feel like it feels at times it's kind of impossible to make this work and i feel like yeah sometimes circumstances may make it look like it's impossible but it's because there's a lot of distance in between you two there's a lot of years or months away there's a lot of like things and situations happen in each one of you guys' life that keep the keeps the connection in such detour and energetically you guys really want to make it work but physically and what we actually live in there's a lot of things in the way that is quite making it impossible or super hard you know with the seven of cups in the reverse right here pisces cancer scorpio you have been their love of their life honestly pisces you are their love of their life and they acknowledge that they acknowledge that you know that no matter how much they try they will never find somebody like you they will never feel comfortable or as comfortable with anybody the way they felt with you they're like you know what like i just feel so drawn to this person they have never found anybody like you or people that they feel as comfortable with as they have done with you with the five of pentacles right here often they ask how can i with towards your capricorn how can i actually feel this connection again they often ask like what am i doing wrong that i can't connect with people the way i did with pisces i do feel like you guys had such an intense connection that it was a perfect fit but maybe this was the right person at the wrong time i feel like in both parties something was happening i feel like it was too much happening in your life and in their life at the moment or it could be one or the other but overall there was what this is why things did not work or got the way they wanted to go with you but i do feel like they often compare how they feel with you with other people and it's never the same like the vibes you guys had has never been uh found in other people with the ace of cups right here um i do feel like they're trying to work on self-love they're trying to work on other things but i feel like i feel there's something in the way i feel like it's all the things that are happening in each one of you guys' life that is keeping you apart. With the Nine of Pentacles and Reverse, they often um, don't feel like celebrating. Even when they're with the relationships, they don't feel happy there. I do feel right here that it's just you are the love of their life. and But coming to you or being together feels impossible. I feel like I, there's a sense of like... I can never be with Pisces, but I want to be with Pisces. And even though that they are telling that to themselves, it's like they can never find peace into the never being with you kind of energy. With the page of ones right here, I do see that they spy your socials, Pisces. They do look at your social media, especially Facebook and IG. Uh, some of you could have Twitter, but especially saying, talking about Facebook and IG, if you don't have neither, then move on from that part. Simple. But I do see that they, for most of you, for some of you at least, they, they, do, they do actually spy on you. And I feel like, I don't know, I feel like they just don't want to give up on you. They don't want to give up on the connection. With the ten of ones, they they do put themselves in a lot of work. I feel like they're actually diving in into their work into their career because they don't want to think about you. They don't want to feel how they feel every time they think about you. They feel love and they feel pain because the pain of love, literally, of wanting somebody not being with them, is super hard. There's a photo for the lovers here, Gemini energy, that they continue to look and that it brings like butterflies to their stomach with the photo source they tend to look at your photo all the time or a photo all the time imagine how things could have been wondering if you ever are gonna come back into your into their life with the six of cups it's a lot of freaking memories and emotions here you guys shared a lot and you guys help a lot into this person's growth even if you didn't know and yes this person does spy your socials a lot because they just want to see what you're up to um with the five of cups and reverse they live on despair and dissatisfaction when it comes to their love life but yet again they don't they don't say anything because once again it's like what can i do you know that's the energies that they have right now with the three of ones right here in the reverse, they do not know if they should plan for the future. I feel like it's hard for them to plan for a future even with anybody else because you are the person they want. You are the love of their life. But there's a lot of things in the way. 
and I feel like there's a sense of like, um, let's say like, what is it called in English? Oh, let me think, let me pick up my bilingual brain. Um, resistance here from the both, from both parties um, that keeps the connection like going. I do feel that there the person is hurt this person is hurt they they don't feel like the star you think they are <laughs> um you may have a surprise message from this person uh you may have a surprise message from this person they may be breaking i feel like they may break the ice with you um now how you're gonna go about it is on you but i do feel like this person is gonna try to break the ice with you you're gonna find out that they're not happy in that relationship they could be in or that they haven't moved on from you with the eight of swords i do feel like the way that this could be managed it seems to be less heavy than before you both are not as stuck as you guys used to be in the past but i do feel that there's a sense of like distrust or i'm not sure if i should do it kind of energy but with the seven that comes right here this could be because you have options because they could also have options but i do feel like no matter what you guys feel like safe or at home with the chair right here i do feel like there is some sort of movement coming towards you or some sort of movement on the connection with the both of you that's forward and confidently i do feel like no matter the distance no matter the time no matter everything i've been telling you this is gonna be fate pretty much bringing you guys together to get this going or ending with the nine of pentacles right here i do feel like this is some sort of celebration i do feel like it feels like very certain of like you guys will see each other again or that you will meet again this is a certainty of like no matter how far no matter how many years no matter how many months you guys will be seeing this person again with the five of cups and the reverse and it's gonna relieve how you ha both have been feeling for a minute i do see for some of you this could be summer it's talking about summer and the day is the 12th someday i don't know what month is on the 12th something is going to happen um this and this is giving me a lot of summer vibes i do feel that this a video for some of you that is gonna pop that you may see your person or this person and you may know that this person works in social media as well i feel like your person does work on social media or it could be like they do a lot of social media as a hobby but this is a specific video that they're gonna come across and you're gonna see who where they're up to and this could be also a way of like knowing and all that with the ten of swords right here just be careful how you uh what you write to this person when they reach out to you because messages are permanent you know what i'm saying even on snapchat you can take screenshots like everything is permanent be careful how you do that but with the six of cups right here this is a reunion with somebody from the past most likely no matter how much you guys have tried to stay away from them you guys are gonna see them unfortunately for all this of you with herman right here and the reverse virgo energy something or it has been in the dark or somebody has been in the dark like uh hiding from you but they're popping back into your life very very soon i do see that this summer is going to be intense for most of you finally with the seven of pentacles in the reverse right here i do feel like everything that you guys needed to do has been done this is completely different route a different sense and energy so i don't feel like you guys will be wasting your time or even investing much i feel like things are going to happen organically and to finalize i do feel right here that it depends on you you guys want to work it out or not because there is emotion just feelings i do feel like there is work to do but it's not as hard work anymore because you guys seem to be more mature with the seven of swords just be careful how you both talk to each other no you don't want to hurt each other in any way shape or form with the three of ones and the viewers you don't have to plan for the future you don't have to make decisions today or tomorrow let things go let the, let things flow but with the queen of wands right here this person for sure knows that you are the love of their life and we'll see how this is handled but you see like a possible uh reunion and seeing this person again regardless of opposition i feel you guys are gonna see each other again because this person energetically and they acknowledge that you are their love of their life so be ready for that surprise baby And I know you guys have been wanting more readings. I try my best. I'm a mom. My son is on vacation. He has autism. So I'm trying to work as much as I can and keep up with everything else. So remember that, please, as much as I want to record much, I'm my mother first. So give me just a break to, you know, to do my thing because I do love my job. But I get, I'm a mother first. So with this said, this is the possible initials of this person. This could be their last middle or even a nickname as well. So with this said, um, 
Diaz and Diego, BS and Boy, X, Xavier, Ellis and Leo, J, S and Jason, Z as and Zebra, P as and Peter, Y as and Yes, N as and Nina, R as and Rose, A as and Apple, and H as and Hamburger. Keep in mind that these names are just examples so you guys know what kind of initials I'm talking about in case my accent don't let you understand it. So that's that. So um, let's move forward um, with other stuff. Let's see their possible physical description or features for those who are very uh, wondering who this person may be. If you feel like, hey, I have been single for too long, I don't know who you're talking about, this could be a past life connection as well. That's gonna feel familiar. So uh, somebody, it says pregnant, this could be something that as well as a single mother, this could be somebody who is a single parent, perhaps not necessarily pregnant, but this could be somebody who has a kid, somebody who has a round face, uh, somebody who has facial hair, Hispanic or Latino, straight hair, I'm talking about a woman, somebody who's older than you, not that oldie, but you know, older than you, and their natural hair is black, the hair color, and here, Somebody who could be muscular as well. So this could be the fa uh, fa the possible physical feature description of this person. Now let's move forward with the archangel message with archangel number, okay? Or angel, you name it. So Oof, we got six, 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 and it says reflection. And it says, when you allow time for reflection, you allow yourself to see where inner shifts are needed. It is time for you to look at your beliefs and ask, is is this serving me or is it is time for me to release this? Reflect, refocus, and readjust. So well, let me move now with the angel message to finalize your reading, Pisces. Let's see, let's see. Let's see. Okay. It says ask. And it says, um, ask us to help you in this situation and we will immediately go to work on your behalf. We are governed by many universal laws and among them is the free will that allows you to make your own choices and decisions so we patiently await your request and it says have confidence and it says moving forward does not necessarily require you to have confidence in yourself uh, confidence in god is enough along with knowing that god works through you and with you in all ways lean upon us if your confidence wavers and we will buy your courage and faith so this is the end of the reading, guys. Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Again, it's summertime. I'm trying my best with my son and all the things I got to do. So videos are coming. If it's a little bit late, I'm just trying to work on my schedule. But either way, I want to remind you that if you want to follow me on Instagram and or uh, TikTok, it's going to be in the description box below. I also have a Spotify going on, a podcast available now, description box below. You can find my Spotify. Um, if you want to follow me on Facebook as well. I also have an upcoming project for my classes as well as I'm open for personal readings. I'm open on June 8th. You can book right now if you want to. Description box below. Uh, finally as well, I am an Amazon affiliate. Please check out my, store, my Amazon storefront. And um, again, I want to remind you that I have a giveaway going on on YouTube. I most likely will post a video after this. Um... But yeah, I want to remind you as well that I do not offer any free readings outside the giveaways and I never message anybody on any platform for tarot increase or anything. So with this said, thank you guys so much and have an amazing day.